I'm Mr. Oak. What's up everybody? I'm gonna show you how to do uh Skype conversation recording, how to uh record your Skype calls with both audios, you talking and the other person on the other line because I know some people be having trouble with doing that and they have to use mixers and all that bullshit. You don't have to use a mixer on this. What you wanna do now is go to mp3 skype recorder dot com in your browser right now it's under construction but you could probably get it at download.com or other uh, download sites it's just type in mp3 skype recorder and i'm sure somebody has it it's a very small program so once you go ahead and got that and have it installed on your pc netbook laptop whatever it's for mac too you want to open up skype go to tools options options go to events settings scroll down go to manage other programs access to skype you don't see mp3 skype recorder in this please go ahead and uh, add mp3 skype recorder to your api access control once that go ahead and got added click ok click save and now you're ready to use mp3 skype recorder so you open this up before you do anything make sure you make your uh, folder skype conversation destination i got mine saved on desktop skypecom once you hit record it says connect to skype recorder once you make a call it records automatically once you end the call it stops recording automatically which is a cool thing about that and it also has these settings for recorder mode mono stereo joint stereo you also have your recording bit rate 24 32 64 128 and i'm going to show you how it is recorded on your computer so open this folder this is how it's recorded date time outgoing telephone number so it's easily to tell which call is which when you uh, want to go ahead and upload it to YouTube or whatever you want to do with it make a soundboard whatever um I also rename mine so I know which ones is which right after I make the call because it's much easier and it's better organized and that's about it on how I go about making my calls and recording both like sessions of my audio without using a mixer so let me know what you want to my next tutorial to be on it's gonna be on my you know what I actually know what I'm gonna make my next tutorial on and it's gonna be about the auto boards that I use on my prank calls which is a uh, micromedia well it's a non-flash soundboard non-micromedia flash soundboard and it's on jackalator.com slash fmus and it's pretty easy to use and i'll show that off in my next video my next tutorial and i'll show you how to use it and maybe you two want to use it because it's really it's really really easier to make a soundboard using this instead of the micromedia flash if you don't know how to use flash and let me show you how it's how it is right now as this loads up this is the stuck in the elevator guy soundboard and this is how it is right now don't worry about that and just load an mp3 and this is how it is right now this is the beta version of the version 2 stuck in an elevator guy soundboard is going to be up on Jackalator site and once what you do is uh, you drag this over your edit console hit edit console your mp3 will be in a folder once you uh, drag and drop and all you do drag and drop drag and drop drag and drop and the layout is already made for you so you don't have to do anything but drag and drop your mp3 and it's very easy and I'll show you in the next tutorial video how to do this so let me know if you want to see how I go about making the soundboard and I'll make one for y'all and I'll upload it for y'all to use um 
that's about it so let me know what you think rate the video hit